No, wait, wait. Babe, seriously. No, no, why are you girls like this? Most importantly, if um, Zach, mm -hmm. uh, if Karin has been a good girl, mm. then definitely um, Zach will not go to Fatima. Ha! That is just the fact. So you're supporting Zach no, on this one? No, no, hey. A woman that gives you peace is the person you will be with. Okay, you realize Men the fact... Men has come. They always say it. You right. better not oh, okay. be like Zach. Oh, okay, okay. I accept. I would not be anything like Zach. <laughs> I'll be good. <laughs> but I really enjoyed this series all the I time. I did no. too. Yeah, I don't you, want you, it to end. You, you remind me a lot of Karin though. Really? Yeah, sure. <laughs> you look beautiful, by the way. Oh, thank the you. <laughs> Man, um, I can't wait for the next episode, I swear. There's something I want to tell you. Really? Mm-hmm. <laughs> what could that be? You want money? No. I don't know how you'll take it. I don't understand what you said. <sighs> Talk to me, babe. You can tell me anything. We are Buddhists. Talk to me. I'm pregnant. <laughs> wow. Oh, why are you scared? It's a great news. I mean, it calls for celebration. Are you sure? Of course. Come here, sir. Come. Listen, let me tell you this, okay? I thought you'd be upset. No. Listen, this is something that was made by the board of us, okay? What kind of man would I be allowing you to bear the responsibilities by yourself? It would be wrong of me. So hey. come on, cheer up. But my parents, they will kill me if they find out I'm pregnant out of wedlock. Come on, I bet you they will not kill you. You're not the first girl to be pregnant out of wedlock. You don't know my father. I know my your dad. dad. Relax, relax. Would you relax? Good, now come here. Come here. Come here. We're good, right? Hey. I love you. So I hold on. For too. this news, I have something special. Just hold on. Chill for me. How are you going to? Chill for me! Chill for the latest dad in town. Chill for me. <laughs> <laughs> aye, aye, aye. First day I set my eyes on you. You have been one true happiness that I have had. <laughs> From the moment I shared my bed with you, I realized that I don't want you to ever leave my bed anymore if there is you. You're the essence of why I'm happy and the reason why I want to have a family someday. <laughs> Gina, would you be my wife? God, I know please. this is not proper. I know every of all this thing looks like it's not Yes, proper. I'll be your wife. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> she said yes. You said yes. Oh, I love you. I love you. I love everything that you are and whatever you are. Oh, oh, yeah. Babe. So wait, wait. You just made me happy. Yeah. So someday I'm gonna wake up and you're gonna be by my side and I'm gonna say by my, my, my wife and we're gonna say I do and all of those things. Our kids. Oh, I love you. I love you too. Oh my God! You beautiful, right? You're beautiful. I know you want to take pictures for the grandma and all that, right? <laughs> I can't wait to tell my friend. I know, I know. Oh. Come here, baby. <laughs> I'm not the bride, but I'm ready to mingle. Oh, yeah. I'm not the bride, but I love the bride. Oh, <laughs> I'm not the bride, but I am the slay queen. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hi guys, I'm not the bride. I am the maid of honor. Woo. <laughs> Hi guys, I'm the bride. Oh, yeah.
Yeah. Okay. okay. So Sophia, you go Come first. On. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. A very simple question. Uh -huh. This one is simple. Shoes. <laughs> okay, so what is his favorite meal? Mm. Me and my body, of course. Oh! <laughs> That's my girl. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> mm. Mm. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> I wasn't okay, okay, expecting that. I might be naughty, but I must ask you this question. Okay. And you must answer me. Mm -hmm. All right, no problem, I promise. Okay. What is his favorite sex position? Hey. <laughs> Next question, please. <laughs> <laughs> you must answer us. Oh, okay. no, nah, girls, she's All shy. Right. Shy is boring. Right. Okay, I'll answer you. Okay, I want to say you. Good. <laughs> okay, he likes. He likes it raw. Okay. <laughs> he likes 360. Oh, oh shit. Yeah. He likes doggy style. <laughs> and he likes missionary style. Okay, okay. I'm coming here with our last question. Going to be doing, not not doing. I look at my shoes. My shoes. My shoes. I'd like to say thank you so much for. That, that unlucky girl will find you someday. You just be waiting for that day that God will bring that big change in my life. <laughs> just be like, no, let's go. <laughs> Wear your suit. No, 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 no. Good. Good. This is how uh, a, a group should work, right? Yeah. This is how it should work. No more. Yeah. No more. Right. Gina and Uchina, are you here in marriage without coercion, freely and wholeheartedly? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Are you willing to take this part of marriage to honor and to love each other for the rest of your lives? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Are you willing to raise lovely children that God will bless you with and to raise them under the law of Christ and his church? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. 
since is your intention to enter a covenant of holy matrimony. Take your right hand and make your intentions known unto God, family and friends. I, Uchena, I promise I vow to take you as my wife for the rest of my life, always and forever, in sickness and in health, forever and always. I, Gina, take you, Uchena, as my lawfully wedded husband, to have and to hold in sickness and in health all the rest of my life. <laughs> and so, Father, I bless your servants in love, O oh Lord. And Father, may this ring be a reminder of your faithfulness. O oh Lord, Father, we ask that you continually remind them of the love they share between themselves for as long as they live. In the name of the Father, of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Uh, I, Uchena, I use this ring as a symbol of my undying love for you, Uchena, for the rest of my life, always and forever. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I, Gina, I give you this ring as a symbol of my love and fidelity to you. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I bless this marriage in the name of the Father, of the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. You may kiss your bride. Woo! Woo Tell me, tell me, tell me, what am I going to address you as now? Well, uh -huh. from now on, uh -huh. you can only address me as uh -huh. Mrs. Uh -huh. Gina uh -huh. Uchena. Uh -huh. Come here. <laughs> <laughs> You're now officially Mrs. Uchena. Yeah. Uchena. Oh, yeah. You know how many kids I want to have? How many? I practically want to have about I mean, six, maybe five, eh? five boys and one girl as the last one. And Babe, it's gonna, whoa. we're having three. Please. No, I won't Who's sing. going to carry them? I'm on you now. Your no, father, I want to be you. a baby girl for life. <laughs> Come here, baby. Come here. Oh, baby. I love you. Of course I can do when I have to. 
Thank you, baby. You're, You're welcome. You know you're the best thing that happened to me, right? Oh, I mean, I love you. You're every girl's dream. No, so before you eat, let's eat. <laughs> yeah, so sweet. All right, this is what we're gonna do. Right, um, um, the shower is gonna be ready. There's hot water there, ready for you, waiting for you. Okay. So you get it. So okay. you're gonna join me when you're done, right? Yeah. All right, come here. <laughs> <laughs> All right, babe. Thank you. Your shower will be ready. Just finish it in and come up. All right. All right. I'm waiting for you in the shower. <laughs> Just glowing anyhow. Mm -hmm. I'm so do good, <laughs> baby. Look at it, hotty, hotty. Mm. Oh my goodness. Mm -hmm. Oh, I tap into this your blessing. I tap into <laughs> this blessing in Jesus' name. Oh shit, pa wa ta pa. This girl. But tell me something. Mm. How did you convince him? What are you talking about? Hmm. You and I know what I am talking about. So how? Ah, ah. Okay. This is not the place for that kind of conversation. What's wrong with you? <laughs> Come off it, Joe. I mean, is it not just you and I in this whole big house? Mm -hmm, also. That's why he's not here now. Hmm. This is good. You're not putting me into trouble, oh. Which trouble? Did you like gist? Eh? Why not go like gist? Who not like gist? <laughs> After you've heard the same gist like a hundred times. Even though, even though. Don't blame me. <laughs> <laughs> but girl, ah, mm -hmm. is this not incredible? Ah, oh God. Mm -hmm. And you even got married to a rich man mm -hmm. that doesn't even know he's not the father of that child. Ah, <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. What? Uh -huh. Am I lying? Well, a child is a child. Uh -huh. Yeah, it doesn't matter. I mean, at the end of the day, it's just our mind playing tricks on us. Mm. Don't you see? Mm. Like, what's the difference between a child that is yours and the one that is not? Anyways, no difference. No difference at all. That's the gospel <laughs> according to Gina. Oh, shit. <laughs> <Bad days. laughs> you know what? Mm -hmm. The next guy I'm going to catch, uh, I will make sure he doesn't use protection. No? Uh -uh. Babe. See yeah, you they now. plan. They play. <laughs> Just they play. I, mean, I want to trap him. Once it enters like this, mm -hmm. eh, I have him locked right <laughs> here. <laughs> Not letting go. Are you See serious? You there. Okay, now. <laughs> These are the jokes. Are you serious? <laughs> 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 eh? What, what, what is it? Oh my God. Are you okay? I don't know. I don't know. Oh no, the field of what? shopping. Ah! Ah! See? So, babe, get my phone. Get my phone. Your phone. Get where? Phone. where? Okay. okay. Ah! Sorry. Oh my God. Sorry. What, what do I do? Your husband. Go Your husband.
<laughs> oh wow. <laughs> it's so good to have you here. Ah, uh, it's good to see you two again. I know what I say. Uh, say, I'm happy you're here, right? I don't know what I'll have done. I mean, she's refused to eat since morning. She's just been by herself. I don't know what to do. Are you, are you serious? Yes. I mean, what can we do about this? I really don't know what to do. Oh, oh my goodness. Where is she? She's inside. Let me just call her for you, right? Yeah, please do. Thank you so much. Maybe please. I can help. Yeah, sure. Okay. Thank you. All right. Thank you. It's okay. <sighs> Friend is here to see you. I'm not around. Come on. There's somebody out there waiting for you, wanting to see you because she cares. Please just tell her to go away. Oh. I'm tired. I don't want to see her. Just go out there again. now and tell her that uh, your friend said I should tell you that I don't want to see you, that um, she doesn't care about you and the fact that you care about coming here, you should just go away and she doesn't want to see you. Is that what you want me to say? I didn't say that. And that's what it looks like. She's out there wanting to see you. Just go there and say hi. There's nothing more than that. Just say hi. Babe. Just go there and say hi to her. And you can come back and sob all you want, but just go say hi to the woman. Good. That's more like it. like this. Have you been eating at all? I just lost my child. I know. I know. But this whole drama is just too much. Drama? Oh, you call all this acting drama? I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry. I didn't mean it that way. I'm sorry. Look, you need to put yourself together. I mean, look at you. My goodness. I think what happened is the best thing that happened to you. What? I, I thought you were my friend. I am your friend. And that is why I'm here to bring you back to reality. Because you're obviously not living. Look at you. Do you want him to find out? Not here. Okay. Exactly. What are you doing? Exactly. You need to put yourself together. Rejoice. Because at least now you don't have to, 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 to deal with paternity fraud issues. Come on. Baby girl. You're his wife now. And you can have as many children as you want later. But for now, you really, really need to come out of mourning. You have to. Oh, look, very soon he's going to have his eyes out there for other women that are prettier and more sexy than you are. You need to come out of this, baby. Come on. Hmm? Yes, you're right. Of course, I'm always right. I wasn't thinking about it this way. Come you on. wouldn't. Oh, come here. Oh, my child. It's okay. It's okay. Come on. Mm. I have no idea. It's okay.
So this period has come out again. Not again. God, when am I going to get pregnant? Can't I just... Can't I just conceive? It has happened before. Why is it so difficult to come back again? What have I done? I was wondering where you were. Babe, don't tell me you're crying again. No. No, no. Come on. Relax on all of these stuff. It's going to be fine. No, it's not. When are we going to ever experience some good news in this family? Babe. When? We have everything that we need. We do. We don't, babe. We don't. Babe, just in due time you're going to have a child. Everything is going to be okay. Just relax. You're stressing yourself so much about it. And when you stress so much about things like this, it's not definitely not going to work. So babe, please. Come, 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 please. Come, come. Just tired. Don't be, don't be. You're doing good, okay? Children are blessings from God. And God will bless us, okay? Relax. Hello, Ma. Good day, Ma. No, Ma. I was busy in the kitchen just trying to make food. Um, I'm cooking, Ma, so my husband is not around. So I'm just trying to make something for him before he gets back. Thank you, Ma. Stream that thing. Oh. Babe, I have, I have told you times right now about to stop drinking all of all these concussions they brought for you. I have told you a lot of times. It smells like a pig, it was made in a pig pen. Your mother sent it over. Now you know where it came from. My mother brought sent it over. I mean, just. Just you should be drinking all of all this nonsense now. Yeah? See, my mother gave you poison to drink, you drink it like that. See, see, I'm a political guru.
I told you that the number of stops was not drinking on the police rubbish. Babe, babe, what is wrong with you? What is wrong with you, babe? What? Uche, now what is it? Let's, let's, okay, I'm just suggesting the fact that okay, we could try an adoption. It's going to be okay. God forbid it. God forbid we bring a strange blood into this family. What is your problem? Take a good look at yourself. Look at you. Huh? Since all this is all, you don't even look sexy anymore. You look like you dress like this all the time, and I don't even see anything good in you again. Just because you're trying to get a baby. Thank you very much, Uchena. Thank you. Uh -uh. I love your honesty. I don't look sexy. I look terrible, right? Thank you. Thank you. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Why are you both sounding like I'm the only one looking for a child here? Really? All I'm trying to say is this, if we adopt a child into this family, at least all these emotions are going to be rested a little, then God can bless you with your own child afterwards. No, 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 Uchina. I will not allow you to speak negativity into this family. Look, I'm off to fire ministry. You are actually supposed to follow me, but no, I'm the only one left to carry the family burden on my own head. Just me. It's fine. It's okay. I am not wicked. I am not going to stay up all night praying for what? Like this, you, you, you will not even rest enough to be fertile enough to have a baby because you're not resting. What is all this? What? You want to kill yourself because you don't have a child? Are you the first? Look at yourself because of all this. We don't even enjoy this marriage anymore. I am tired. What is this? Please, if you want to pray, go and pray elsewhere, please. My fault. We should just go to the altar then. Become, become reverend. the universe is trying to punish you for lying to him? Haven't they punished me enough? Oh, is it until I die before they will stop? 
Wait. Does he even know you lied? <sighs> okay, what is your problem? Why are you just interested in this talk? Oh, so you want me to go and tell him that? Ah, my dear husband, I lied to you about our first pregnancy, which is the reason you proposed to me in the very first place. Would that make you happy? Well, I was only trying to help. Well, you're not helping. Okay, okay. you're not helping at okay, all. Okay, 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 it's okay. My pastor gave me passages to read. <laughs> Look, just take it easy, Sha. Hmm? You know that God's time is the best. Because look at me now. I am still a single Pringle. But I'm taking it easy. Until Mr. Wright finally swings by. Anyways, that's by the way. How are you really? Like, really, really, how are you? How do you think I am? No, really. I'm just hanging in. God, I'm tired. you need to take care of yourself, oh. And you need to take it easy. I mean, look at you. Uh -uh. You're looking way older than I am. Who does looking good help, really? All these things are vanity. <laughs> it's the oh. truth. <laughs> I'm not joking. Okay, okay. I've been okay. inviting for Bible studies. You, you think I'm playing with you. I'm not uh, even joking with you. It's serious here. We're getting older. We should be more focused in our life. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay Mommy Gio, I hear you. Okay, okay, I hear you. Uh, don't blame you. <laughs> you have not seen life. <laughs> It's okay. <laughs> I've seen every side to life. You better change your ways. <laughs> I'm on a more serious note. <laughs> but babe, okay. this thing is not easy. I'm telling you. I know. <sighs> I know. <sighs> but like I said, go easy. This mm -hmm. is well. It is. Oh my God. Which scene in particular am I paying for? Lord have mercy. <sighs> I could be thinking of my lies. Meanwhile, oh, baby. <laughs> come on. My dear, I, I, you kept me waiting, like I've been worried. I'm sorry. So tell me what happened. Actually, it wasn't my intention. No. That Mr. Lawson of a man, his sister, that we all should wait after class. Well, uh, Mr. Lawson, whatever you call him, it's okay by me, huh? <laughs> you call me. Hi, okay. Hi, Brian. Uh, How are you doing? I'm good. You look good. Thank you. Thank you. Uh. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I have to leave you guys for a moment. For, yeah. for you guys to enjoy your moment, so I'm going to rush back home. My mom called me, so I rush back home. Okay. Whatever. No problem. <laughs> All right. Please come. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Remember our promise that no man must see our panties till the wedding day is with Trust me. Sure. Sure. I'll stop. Sure. All right. Okay. Bye. She'll be with you tomorrow. Okay. Bye. <laughs> I do, Gina. See, if I don't love you, what would I be doing here? I mean, where would I be with you? Or, or you think I, I, I just do this with every girl I come across on a daily basis? The answer is no. See, my dear, I, of all the girls in this school, and of all the girls outside this school, I single-handedly chose you. Gina, you are all I have ever dreamt of in a woman. And there's no going back. I love you, Gina. Let me hold you by your word. I promise you'll never break my heart for any reason. I promise. I promise never to break your heart for any reason whatsoever. I love you, Gina. And mm -hmm. <laughs> Hold on. Babe, something is running through my head right now. 
I'm scared of losing you and whenever I think about that it's it burns my heart a thousand times. So I, I thought of what if we take an oath to be with each other together forever? Huh. Don't say that again. Do you know the implication involved in both the kids? Yes, I know. And I am ready to stick by it. You see, there is nothing that is going to happen to either of us except you have intentions of breaking my heart tomorrow. See, if, if we stick by the oath we take, there is nothing that will happen to us except either party does otherwise. See, baby girl, I really want to do this with you. Let's give this a chance. I'll have to think about it. And to make some inquiries about it too. Uh, it, so it, I don't make mistake tomorrow. Ah, Gina. I thought that you're supposed to be at home by now. Why are you still doing here? I'm uh, easy. Um, um, Gina, I'll have to. We'll talk later. Uh, hi. Yay! Yeah. Ah, good work, girl. Ah. Why you look so worried as though the world is coming to an end? What is wrong with you that you can't share with me? Eh? Priscilla, mm -hmm. can I ask you a question? Oh, sure, why are we friends? Problem shared is half solved. Come on. From the look of things between I and Rian, do you think that Rian loves me? Of course he does. I envy you guys though, seriously. I love the way he showers you with so much love. Come on. You should be appreciative. Put on a minute. He's now demanding that we should take our place. What? You don't mean it. Now you know why I'm worried. Huh? Because I'm too tender for such risk. But can't. it doesn't mean. It's nothing. He's only trying to prove his love to you. That's all. Seriously. Think about tomorrow. What if things turn around? Who loses? It's not a bad idea, seriously. He's just trying to prove that he truly loves you. He wants to secure you. He doesn't want another man to take you. He gets. Reason I'm now. Okay. The ball is in your court. Use it wisely. You okay. get. Okay. Mm -hmm. So why would you want me to follow you to your house? What will your parents say? Forget about my parents. I have told you countless times without numbers that they travel for their leave holiday and will not be returning back until two months' time. <sighs> if you truly love me, then why are you avoiding me? Why? I'm scared. And it anything may happen. I have promised my parents to stay like this until the wedding bell rings. Of everything that I have said to you, Gina, why do you still doubt me? Gina, I want to remain like this with you forever. And I mean every single word that I say to you. Mom once told me to love everyone and trust nobody, including myself. Okay, I got it. Including me, I'm not an exclusion. But it's fine, if you can still not trust me after all we've been together. Goodbye. Please, I don't mean to hurt you. Forgive and forget. Please. Just forgive me. Okay, I promise to follow you to your house. I promise. Really? Are you for real? Yes. <clears throat> okay, um, if so then, you are forgiven. Take my hand. Take my heart and take my body. I will sacrifice them all as long as you can keep them safe. Baby, them that you love me. Of course. You know I can keep them safe. And even if I tell you I love you a thousand times now, I will not stop or change the fact that I love you even without saying it. You yeah. know that I love you a thousand times and nothing can ever stop me from loving you. What is 
busy with your mood. Now that you have taken my pride, promise you will not break my heart. Okay. Now listen. I promise from the depth of my heart, with everything that I have, that I am not going to break your heart. Not this time and never. Okay? Stop. I just disappointed my parents. I hit myself for doing this. Will you stop this and come on, stop acting up? What is this? Fine. Can we take the oats now? Please. What? I, you mean the oats? No. no I, you, 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 see, you, you have to calm down. Not this time. Let's just give this a little time, please. I won't sit now, please. I Let said it. we would take it, but not now. I brought this idea of taking the oath, and I'm still saying not now. We haven't even, we've not even married, we're not even married, and you're, you're disobeying me already. Please. Please. Let's take the oath, please. Listen, please. listen. Okay, I'm okay, okay, friends. okay, hold on, please. You see, it's not that I don't want to take the oath with you. Okay. This is what happened. Okay. I, I discussed this with my mom and I told her about you, that I love you so much and that I want to take an oath with you, but she discouraged me and said that this whole oath taking thing is very, very dangerous and it could lead to a disaster. So I thought of it and I decided, I decided to think about it properly and I came to a conclusion that I'm still going to do my mind, but I still think we should be patient. At least, just wait for a while. Tina, what's up with Tina? How are you doing? I'm fine. Uh, why your straight face? I did it. And you did what? I did it with you. Tina, you did. Wait, you speak in a slang I don't understand. Please break it down for a better explanation. For a better understanding. Honestly, I never wish to. But something led to something. And I was lost. Tina, are you okay? Why do you have to go that extreme? Do you even know what you've caused upon yourself? Your pride, your dignity. Even your covenant you made to your mom. Tina, come on now, this is not you. Even the promises you made, you, you, you broke everything. What, what is all this? What are you even telling me? What are you telling me? Our father, I, I promise I, I'm not going to do this, I'm not going to do that. Look at you. You gave it out. You gave it out. Come on, come off it, Joe. I'm, I'm, so, I'm, I'm so disappointed, please. I'm sorry. Since three days now, you barely take my cup. No, even returning back. No problem, I'm taking all the blames. Why, why, why won't he take your call when you've opened for him already? When you broke up, oh, okay, where is Brian now, sir? He really takes my call. Please, I want you to keep well, this well, well, for me. Please. Please. Keep what? When you go out, open for me. Please, please, please. I want you to keep this secret. It's okay, that's it's okay. That's not even my mother. I'm please. your friend, right? And yes. you trust me. Yes. And I trust you. I won't betray you. Have my word. Thank you. Okay? Okay. I'm thanks. doing this because you are just my friend though. Thank you. Thanks. But wait, wait. By the way, wait. Hope he used protection. Or did you let him penetrate in their world? I don't know. I don't know if he uses protection. Don't but even do. I felt since then is just pain and bleed. I don't know. I don't know. I just pray I'll be safe. I pray you are safe. Don't worry. Nothing's going to happen to you, okay? Don't worry. But I don't, I don't like what you do, to be honest. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, don't, I don't even like it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We are not here. In fact, I am not here to tell you both to be in a relationship or a dating. All I'm here to say today, yeah, is that your girlfriend, Gina, is carrying your child. Will you shut up that thing you call your mouth before I give you a blow that will send you back to your ancestors? Can you imagine? 
Is that, oh, that is how you do at home, eh? Oh, no wonder I see. Best of the same feather. Eh? Now, listen. Let me ask you. Were you the one that was holding that torchlight for us when we were doing it? For you to know that it's my responsibility. Eh? You see the kind of people you move out, you move, you move out with? Eh? Now, for your own good, eh? you better go and look for whoever planted that nonsense that you call the child inside you. Because I am definitely not the father to this. I don't know. I am not a party to this. So, hope you are hearing me now. No, 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 no. Don't even say anything. Oh, this is how you people go about real young boy's life. Eh? Young men with bright future. You go about with this your two left legs. Kunkere, kunkere, kunkere. That's how you go to real. Now, but listen, this one has failed. Hmm? You have totally failed. Fe o fe. Failed. Eh? Ah, for your information, don't ever let me see you in my house again. If you, if my, I don't want my parents to hear about this. So you better go and look for whoever. Next one, let me. Why am I even talking too much? See, eh? Um, it is good. I want to inform you both that my parents have prepared visa for me to go and further my education abroad. Yes. So, what I am saying is, whatever you know you can do to terminate this thing, you better do it. After all, after the whole thing, me and you enjoyed the whole thing now, eh? Didn't you enjoy it? I took care of myself. Why didn't you take care of yourself? My dear, go and look for you to take care of yourself. Oh. Hold on. Wait. Okay, what now happened to me, to our unborn child? You and who? Eh? I don't understand. You better it's understand. All these things. You better understand because when this whole thing was happening, was happening, it's not that it was only me that was enjoying the thing. After all, you, uh, you, it's part of the worst is that you don't even have a very good, a good ringtone. You're just, mm, mm, mm. it's paining me, it's paining me. Mm. I'm not even enjoying it. And here they're coming to tell me that I should pay for, I should take responsibility of what I did not even enjoy. I don't have anything to say. You push it. Carry your two left legs now and get out of my house I before promise. my parents comes back. Leave my house. I promise you will never hear a cry of a baby in your life. Thank you. I promise. I bet with you, you, you will suffer for this. You don't even know how to say bet. You say bite. I bite with you. You will suffer. It's oh, all right. It's you will all right. Suffer. It's all right, oh, Frank. It's just that God will punish you for us. Punish you too. God will punish you. Punish you. you. See, ah, leke, leke. You come and get yourself involved in what involved. does not concern you. That's how you could just go, 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 go about implicating people's children. Look at a whole me. Do I even know? Have I even reached the stage to impregnate a pregnant woman for you to come and even tell me that I pregnant you? Lord. Please forgive me. How many times do I have to apologize before you hear me? I know I was wrong for lying about my pregnancy, but it has been five years. Did you not say in your word that even if our sins be as black as coal, you will make us whiter than snow? I am helpless, Father. Please, hear my cry and wipe this shame from my eyes. Make me a real woman again. Please. Babe, my friend told me something very interesting. Fertility specialist. Apparently, he's like so popular, and a lot of people know him. I'm just hearing about him, but I'm ready to give him a call, you know, so that we can just book an appointment. When do you think you'll be free? Hmm? Can we not do this tonight? Do what? Can we just be happy as we are right now and ignore any of all these worries and just be married like we used to be? In one night without you worrying about all this fertility thing, can we just rest on it? Hey, but at least he can tell us what our problem is. I don't know why you don't support me in things like this. I'm trying here. I mean, what was so bad in us, you know, seeking help? There's nothing for good or seeking help. For once in our lives, once in our very boring, already pathetic life, can we just be happy and forget the fact that we don't have kids? 
Can you just even let me see my wife like the sexy woman she is once more? Without worrying and nagging in my ears about this kid, can we just do it for once in our lives again? Damn, just to say this mood was the sweetest of them all and now it's both again. How am I even gonna get an infection to be with you? Hi there. Hi. How are you doing? I'm fine, thank you. I am so sorry I kept you waiting. I was practically finishing up some meetings inside the house. No, it's fine. Sure. It's, yeah, it's so fine. have you called your friend? Um, yes, I called her. Uh, she's in some ministry like that. Oh, that's my wife for you. <laughs> 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 um, uh, actually, I'm not here to see her. I'm here to see you. Yes, uh, there is something I need to talk to you about I mean I know that Gina is my friend and she's like a sister to me but I just hate the fact that she has been keeping you in the dark for so long I hate it uh, I don't follow I know five years ago you proposed to her right um, yes that's the best thing I've done in my life mm. I'm not so sure about that I still do not follow. Okay, this is it. She was pregnant for another person. I mean, that pregnancy belonged to another guy. A guy she was dating when we were in school. And when she was pregnant, she was dating you as well. I mean, she was dating you and the other Hey, baby. young woman, listen and listen good, okay? You're gonna take your red devil wearing self and walk out of my house. I love my wife and I love my wife so much, okay? Unless you can repeat everything you just said in presence of my wife. If you cannot, then I think you should get your red devil self out of my house right now. <laughs> you don't understand. I mean, you don't understand the magnitude of this. I mean, she tricked you. Woman, I'll say this and I'll say it again. Pick your red self and leave my house right now. <laughs> okay. So unbelievable. I thought as much. Daredevil, red walking devil. Wow. <laughs> Thank you very much. It's fine, okay? I think I'd have to um, talk Uchenna. to you later then. Let me call you back. So this is the reason? This is the reason you've been calm all this while? How could you? How could you do this to me? You watched me drink all those concussions that your mother insisted on sending over. You watched me pray and fast every other day. And you said 
Nothing. How did you... How do you sleep at night? How... How do you allow your conscience take this? How? Say something or I swear to God you take! What do you want me to say? Why did you lie? If you think about it, technically I did not lie. I just didn't say a thing. So, you don't feel bad about this? Oh my God. Oh my God. I married a monster. <laughs> don't you oh go God. There. Don't you dare go to where you're going to right now. Don't you dare. What are you talking about? Okay, good. You realize the fact that you were pregnant with another man's child and you were cool enough to bring that child roam around this house like this was my child. I thought it was a win-win situation. That's why I allowed it, knowing the fact that I know that I was infertile and you were with another man's child. At least we could call that child our child, growing around in our house. And this was an opportunity for me to still be with the woman that I love. Don't you see that that was a win-win situation? I allowed that. If you're looking for a monster, maybe you take yourself to the mirror. Look into the mirror and bet me you're going to see the biggest monster that ever walked the face of Earth. Why did you propose to me that day? Why? I did what I did. I proposed into you because I loved you. Because I found an opportunity to be with the woman that I love. It doesn't matter if the child is not mine. It's a win-win situation. You lied about the child, and I lied about me being able to pregnant a woman. Oh my God! Where are you going to now? What do you want to do? Just leave me alone. You lied to me, and to think my friend Oge warned me. She mentioned it, she said it, that maybe there's something wrong with you, but I told her to shut up. I hushed her. She was right. Oga is not your friend, okay? What are you talking about? I'll tell you something you don't know. I understand the fact that I wasn't fertile, but then I still would have found out even if I was fertile. Because your friend Oge walked in here to tell me the fact that our child wasn't mine. You're a liar. Oh, that's what you think, but trust me. She is not your friend, and I'm saying what I'm saying. Leave me, babe. Just leave me alone. I will not leave you, babe. This is another opportunity for us to be together. I love you, you love me. You liar. Babe, we can still adopt children. We can. Please, I beg of you, love. Please, be with me. Don't go nowhere. Be with me, love, I beg you. I would be the man of your dreams. I'll do anything you want me to do. I'll always be there for you. I promise I would, please. Please, love, please. Just don't go nowhere, love, please. 